This is Asuma bringing you another Minecraft tutorial. This is the ultimate quick kit, a customizable machine that refills your hotbar in the desired order and dispenses you with armor and customizable amounts of items of your choice, preparing you to go back out into the Minecraft world in just under 30 seconds. Before we start the tutorial, I'm going to give you a quick explanation of how this machine works and how you can customise it. So, you start off by standing on the pressure plate and pressing the button, which is going to send a signal down through these repeaters, and activating these dispensers one by one, which will fill up your hotbar in that particular order. So when it gets to the end, it branches off in two directions. First of all, it goes along these repeaters to these four dispensers which have the armor in, and this is where you can start to customize the machine. You can put an extra dispenser at the end if there's another item you want one of, and you can even put another Thor back here, but these four will interfere with the order of your hotbar. So the other uh, place the signal goes is down here to this logic gate, which is linked to the pressure plate at the beginning, so it's only activated while you're still standing on that. Um, it activates this piston which creates a pulse and it activates all of these dispensers here. So the one that we have at the end here gives you arrows, it fires them into the wall here so when you're standing on this pressure plate the piston is extended and when you try and walk out it retracts um, and gives you enough time so you can walk past and pick up the arrows without getting shot. So the other way that you can customise this machine is by choosing what items you put in these dispensers. Uh, the amount that you get from them is based on how long you stand on the pressure plate for. So if you wanted more cobblestone in your inventory than you did apples, you could have one dispenser full of apples and you could make three or four full of cobblestone. So you can strike up a balance for what you want in your inventory. To build the ultimate quick kit, we're going to need a whole bunch of resources. So I have them here in this chest. We're going to need 87 building blocks and that can be of any type as long as they're not a block that interferes with redstone or anything like that. Uh, we're also going to need 16 ice, 21 dispensers, 24 redstone, 25 redstone repeaters, 6 redstone torches, 2 sticky pistons, 1 normal piston, 2 buckets of water, a stone slab, a pressure plate and a button. To build this you're going to need a flat area of land that is 6 blocks wide and 14 blocks deep and in this tutorial we're going to do everything layer by layer so this one being the first of 6 in total. So for our second layer we want to start off by placing five blocks in a row at the front like this and then another five blocks behind it and three over on this side like this. Then you want to place down some redstone leading from this block all the way to this one over here which we're going to put a redstone torch on the side of, then a repeater on the default setting facing into this block which we're going to place and on the other side we're going to have another repeater facing into that. Then on the side of this block we've got a torch and two redstone wires either side of that with a repeater again on default setting facing into this block and then we're going to place two blocks here then three in a row here and another one on the end and last of all we're going to put the torch on this block. For the third layer we're going to start off by placing five blocks in a row at the front like this then two blocks over here to the side of it then place down the stone pressure plate, a piston then this is eight blocks in a row then a dispenser and two more blocks then you want to place down seven ice on the side of those blocks we just placed and nine ice here going two blocks out at the end. Then over here we're going to place a block above the torch that we placed in the previous layer and then we're going to put down this redstone dust and all of this redstone dust over here as well. For the fourth layer we're going to start off by placing these ten blocks in a row going all the way down to the end here. Then we've got one block at the end, two to the side of it and then these seven dispensers in a row on top of the blocks we placed in the previous layer and then at the end here you can put a block on top of the piston. Now you can place in the water, you're going to put one water source block here and another one just here and then behind those dispensers we can place another seven blocks in a row and then you'll need to place down these two redstone wires, uh, this one that's on top of the dispenser you place by right clicking on the side of that block. Then at the back here we have a sticky piston and a block attached to the end of it and behind that we have this redstone torch and then last of all you need to place this block over here and a redstone torch on the side of it. For the fifth layer we're going to start off by placing this block here, it's three blocks in from the side and it's got a button on the side of it, then we've got a sticky piston behind it facing upwards, this half slab and then we have three blocks here. Then you want to place nine dispensers in a row 
and at the end here you've got this group of four blocks and then another four blocks on this side another four dispensers and another block at the end and then you just need to place down some redstone wire we've got seven wires in a row here and then one on top of this block that we placed in the previous layer for the sixth and final layer we're going to start off by placing a redstone wire on top of this block a block to the side of it and that's above the sticky piston then a repeater on default setting facing into this block which we need to place and then you want to place these nine blocks in the middle like this and they're in line with the dispensers then you need to replace all of these repeaters and all of these are on the fourth setting and the way you place the repeaters on top of the dispensers is like with the redstone dust you right click on the side of the block but you can see that it faces the wrong direction so you need to hit it from an angle like this and then it will face the right direction so those repeaters go all the way down to the end here and then we place this block another repeater on fourth setting another block with a redstone torch on the side of it and then more repeaters going all the way down this side to the last dispenser So that concludes this tutorial and I'd like to say thank you to EthosLab for the original idea of the quick kit and you can find a link to his channel in the description box where you can also find a link to download this map and as well as that there's a list of the resources needed to build this and as always if you have any comments or questions you can get in touch with me via the comment box. So thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.